Staff Sergeant First Class Martin Gold, clarinetist and bass clarinetist with the United States Army Band Pershing Zone. Today, I'm going to get you started on this glorious, glorious instrument. Follow me. If you've ever played piano, you might be a little bit confused because the fingering system we talk about on clarinet is a little bit different. So on clarinet, we just do thumb, one, two, three, pinky. Thumb, one, two, three, pinky. All right, so let's try to get this so you can see both hands. But just remember, like on clarinet, left hand on top, right hand on bottom. On your left hand, your thumb is gonna control this pad right here. Your first finger, your index finger is gonna control this one. Middle finger, ring finger, and eventually, not right now, but your pinky is gonna control all of these. All right, then your left hand, your thumb rests in the back here, under the thumb rest, just like on clarinet. First finger, second finger, third finger, or if you will, index, middle, ring. Pinky controls all these down here, but that's not for a while. Okay, for today, we're only gonna do the left hand. We're only gonna talk about the left hand and the first five notes. All right, I think we're ready to try a note. Okay, so the first thing is remember, uh, thumb, Controls this pad right here. First finger, second finger, third finger. We're not even gonna worry about the pinky today. So I want you to just take your thumb and first finger and play that note right there. Think about everything we talked about with the embouchure, the breathing, everything else. And that is an E. Now you try it. All right, let's take away the index finger and just leave the thumb. And this is what we should get. All right, you try it. All right, now with those two notes, you can actually play your first tune. Jaws, of course. Now, take away both the thumb and the first finger and you should get this. This is our open note, no fingers anywhere. And what note do you suppose that is? It is a G. So now you've got E, F, G. Can you try that, just those three notes? Great, let's go back to the E. And let's add your middle finger now. And that is a D. You try it. Now let's add your ring finger. And that is a C. Can you think of any notes that you can play with these five, or any tunes that you can play with these five notes that we've learned now? Well, we'll, we'll get to one later and then I can give you some more ideas. <laughs> 